Well, CBS2 and the American Society for the Prevention of Cruelty to Animals, the ASPCA, are teaming up to help pets in need find happy homes. Suzanne's here now with the Bark Avenue Foundation and our Pets to Love pet, Abel. All right, Stacy, I'm not sure if I'm just salty or if he really loves me because he won't stop licking. He's such a good dog. This is Abel. And, you know, Abel, look right into camera two for your close-up. Abel literally is one of those dogs who has a second leaf on life, right, Katya? Katya yeah. from the Bark Avenue Foundation because you found him in a South L.A. shelter literally with 24 hours to live. 24 hours, volunteers working hard for him, and thankfully he's okay now. So he's real skinny. He is really skinny. Abel's only about eight or nine months old. He's a baby and he's, got a, he's a great dog, but he's in another kennel now, in a boarding kennel, and he is just stressed out. He really needs a foster home just to rehab, to spend some time, and it's a great way to not commit um, to a forever home. But <laughs> Well, you know what? He's been here with us for the last about 45 minutes at CBS, and I can guarantee you he is such a mellow dog, and all he does is sit and wag his tail and say, like, please, 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 play with me, play with me. <laughs> He is a wagger, and so he loves other dogs. The foster program does allow you to kind of take him for a test drive, right? Absolutely, and, and just give him some love in exchange for a, a happy home, and maybe you want to adopt him in the future. Oh, maybe I do want to adopt you in the future <laughs> if someone else doesn't get him before us. Now, he loves to play ball, and he's good with kids, you said, and that's important for people to know. Definitely. He's a gentle boxer mix, and he's just a really, he's got a great disposition. Oh, Abel, you are so darn cute. All right, somebody's going to get a great dog. Uh, that's it for our Pets to Love segment. Now here's Dr. Catherine Miller with your Pets to Love Tip of the Week. Abel. Daily exercise will not only keep your pet physically fit, but mentally healthy, too. Now, if you have a dog, a couple walks around the block probably won't be enough. Dogs need to run and play every day to stay happy and healthy. If your cat is just a bench warmer, encourage him to run and play by making his toys scurry, jump, and fly around so he'll chase them. Just remember to have fun. This Pet Tip of the Week is brought to you by CBS2 and Subaru. Subaru is proud to work with the ASPCA to bring pets and people together.